Hello, my name is Rodri Morgan. I'm one of the cabinet members at Wandsworth Council, and today I'm here to talk to you about active transport. As you know, if you can replace a car journey by either walking there or cycling there, it's probably going to lower your environmental footprint. And that's one of the reasons why we're supporting so many active travel transport initiatives right here in Wandsworth. We want to normalise active transport as an everyday choice in Wandsworth. This is why we've developed our walking and cycling strategy. We've also facilitated doctor bike surgeries to promote cycling and to teach residents bike maintenance skills. Uh, and we will also ensure our cycle routes are accessible to those with limited mobility. We're improving signage to make cycling and walking and Wandsworth easier and more straightforward. We are also working with third parties, including Southwestern Railway and TfL to improve our Santander cycle coverage. Our strategy also includes a focus on improving driver awareness of how they can keep cyclists safe whilst moving around the borough. We are focusing on developing high quality cycling infrastructure to ensure we maintain our position as one of the fastest growing cycling boroughs in London. The new Northern Line extension to Battersea recently opened, which has increased public transport options. Also, to keep our streets safe for pedestrians and cyclists alike, we are maintaining our 20 mile per hour zones across large parts of the borough. Working with partners like Transport for London and Network Rail to improve transport infrastructure. Additionally, we are looking to improve air quality by delivering 900 on-street EV charging points and we want to develop a national leading EV charging network. This will make electric cars easier to own and run, reducing emissions from petrol and diesel cars. We're also supporting the creation of school streets to improve air quality near schools with 20 schemes already in place around the borough.